Hello and welcome to another edition of the Armourer's Bench. I recently had the chance to take a close look at an M45 quad mount at the excellent Menorca Military Museum. The formidable M45 was introduced in 1943, designed by the Maxon Corporation and mounted four M250 caliber Browning machine guns. The mount was capable of 360 degrees of rotation and could be elevated up to 90 degrees. It was designed for the anti-aircraft role but it could also be used against ground targets. The movement of the mount was controlled by the gunner who sat between the two pairs of 50 caliber machine guns. This was powered by two 6 volt batteries. In a moment we'll take a closer look at the gunner's chair and the controls. Here we can see the two left hand Brownings. These are the TT or turret type variant. Here at the rear of the M45 we can see the storage batteries, the power charger, and some of the solenoids that activated the guns. Apologies for some of the shaky camera work, it was quite tricky getting behind the M45 as it was in the corner of the room. Here we can see one of the sectors which control the elevation of the guns. The M45 was extremely versatile and could be mounted on a large number of trailers and trucks, including the M20 and M17 trailers, the M16, M17 and M51 half tracks. During the Vietnam War, it was mounted on a number of vehicles to create gun trucks. The example we're looking at today is mounted on an M20 trailer, which could be pulled by jeeps or trucks. Let's take a look at the M45 in action in some contemporary footage. Here the Quad 50s go into action. Here we can see the M45's batteries and power charger. The gunner sat on a canvas seat between the pairs of guns. The gunner aimed the M45 using a pair of control handles and a reflex sight. Here we can see the reflex sight mounted on the sight brace. The M45 was manned by a three-man crew, two loaders and a gunner. All four guns could be fired at once but normally gunners alternated between the upper and lower pairs. With all guns firing, the M45 could achieve a rate of fire of 2,300 rounds per minute. The M45 was used extensively during World War II, the Korean War and in Vietnam. With the beginning of the jet age, however, the M45 was increasingly used against ground targets. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick look at the M45. Don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, check out thearmorersbench.com for a full article on the M45.